Hello everybody, happy to Iowa. I am in Iowa right now, so I'm at the uh, Field of Dreams, which if you remember the movie back in 1989 that was made by uh, Kevin Costner. I've always been interested in uh, sports and baseball, so uh, as I was driving to my venue tonight to do ministry at in Fort Atkinson, Iowa, I just uh, felt led to do a search to see if perchance the field of dreams that was in the movie was on my way and sure enough it was so this is uh, again this is the field of dreams they made the movie with Kevin Costner back in 1989 so welcome to Iowa there are cornfields everywhere everywhere I'm driving so I'm going to show people here behind me hello Lisa Hello from uh, Iowa. This is where they made the movie Field of Dreams, which is really, really cool because uh, I love sports. So I'm gonna show you. There's some kids that are like practicing here that are wearing purple, that are pitching here. And it is, there's a cornfield right out here. So if you remember in the movie, they had like Shoeless Joe Jackson that appeared in the corn, and uh, it's kind of cool. There's the uh, house that uh, they had, the original house here, and there's definitely cornfields everywhere that I've been driving in Iowa. So anyway, I did not know that this was on my way to where I'm speaking at tonight, and the Lord likes to surprise me with stuff, so I didn't know this until maybe an hour and a half ago. Decided to Google search to see where the Field of Dreams was uh, actually located at in Iowa. And this was like right on the way. So how cool is that? How cool is that? So neat. And they actually have like a gravel road to get here. You have to drive like for a couple of miles on a gravel road. So it's really uh, neat. So um, this is again, this is uh, definitely Iowa. In fact, I'll walk closer so you can see in the cornfields because I remember in the movie where the baseball players came out of the cornfield. So we'll walk into the cornfield. Look how tall the corn is here. I mean, they have so many cornfields everywhere when I was driving. The only time I've ever been to Iowa was when I was with my dad and I was about, I don't know, maybe 13 years old. We went to the Quad Cities and uh, oh wow, there's a bird eating some corn right there. Yeah, I think I hear people in the corn here. <laughs> anyway, there you go. You need to, to weed inside there. My dad would always make us go through our cornfield and uh, walk it and pick out weeds from the cornfield, like button weeds and stuff. And there's always like cobwebs and junk like that. So again, I've always said that I was a kid from a cornfield because that's where I grew up at. And now I get to actually say, wow, there is a cornfield here at the Field of Dreams. How cool is that? They actually have lights here so you can play. It's so neat. The field looks so nice, nice and green. Looks like they've had a lot of rain here to water it. But how cool is that? So I love it when the Lord surprises. In fact, the Lord's kind of showed me as I was driving here, the theme for the movie was, if you build it, they will come. And Kevin Costner mowed, supposedly, down all this corn or whatever, and then they created a baseball field. And then the uh, 1919, like the White Sox, Chicago White Sox, that were the Black Sox scandal, that uh, they came walking out of the cornfield and they wanted to play. And so the Lord was showing me as I was driving here, if you build it, they will come as the theme of the movie and he told me a year ago in April that if I build out this deliverance team around the world then we will be able to get people set free and get more people to go to heaven and that's what I feel like I know we've gotten now 60 people in six countries that are part of Restored to Freedom looking to have 200 people by the end of this year a thousand people by the uh, end of next year so uh, again the Lord wants to have us build out this deliverance team of end-time warriors to help get people set free to know their authority. 
So, isn't that cool? Hey, Lisa, I saw your comment there. Awesome. Isn't this neat? Isn't this cool? Remember the movie? I think I've only seen it once in my life, but maybe it's time to see it again. But it's kind of neat. There's kids there playing. It's like, ah, oh, I'm a kid again. I want to enjoy life. You know, again, when you have dreams, too, when you get delivered, you can, the dreams you have will come to pass because there's nothing that can stop it now. You know, you've gotten yourself to where you position yourself to where you can receive the uh, desires of your heart. You know, when you are, when you're hearing from the enemy and the enemy has a legal right to you, then you're not going to be able to operate and free, freely flow in the gifts the Lord wants you to have. And, and you won't be able to uh, have a lot of the blessings and the favor when you're operating in the spirits of Jezebel, Leviathan, because you're listening to the voices of the enemy and he's causing you to behave in ways that are not godly, not Christian. So, But when you get set free, you can have the dreams, your desires of your heart. So here I am on the field of dreams. Look at that, there's kids here that are playing and they're catching it behind their back. Remember, I used to do that. That was so cool. So awesome. Maybe we should run the bases. Yeah. I'll go from second base to third base. So cool. Love it. And there's the house. Very nice infield. No big rocks and stuff. So here's second base. Here, now I'm going from second to third. Look at the little doggies over here. So cool. Love it. So again, I'm in uh, Iowa. This is called, I think called Dyersville, which is out in the middle of nowhere. They have uh, gravel roads to get here. It's like uh, east, or no, it's west of Dubuque. But it's like in northeastern Iowa. Iowa. And look at the doggies over there. So cool. There's the house that they built. <clears throat> and it says Field of Dreams movie site. And it's free when you come here. It is free. You don't have to pay anything. Let me show you the front of the house here. Yay! Journey U is Houston's is certified with Restored to Freedom. Love it. If you build it. So yes, we are building out Restored to Freedom around the world. Get people delivered so that Christ can come back for a pure and spotless bride. Christ wants a pure and spotless bride. Isn't this cool? So cool. So cool. Oh my gosh, it says heaven over here. All-star ballpark heaven. It's a sign. We're bringing heaven to earth when you get delivered. Yay. So cool. Look at the baseball team getting lined up for a picture. Thank you. 
So cool. All righty. Well, again, uh, I'm here at the Field of Dreams in Iowa where they made the movie Field of Dreams with Kevin Costner back in 1989. And it's just cool being here. So cool. There's a little girl pitching. So the Lord wants us all to be delivered so that we can be children at heart, have our childlike innocence restored from being hurt by our mothers and fathers, and to be set free and to enjoy life again. Alrighty, well, I will let you guys go. I'll be getting back on the road, heading up to Fort Atkinson, Iowa for tonight to do a deliverance session. And then tomorrow I'll be back on the road again, going to Rapid City, South Dakota, to Mount Rushmore. So I love you guys, praying for you guys, and enjoy your Sunday. See ya, bye.